I've been with WPX hosting for a while and pretty soon I'm going to be announcing that I'm, I've actually switched hosting and I'll go into more details later on about why I'm switching hosting. But I actually do think WPX offers a really nice service, but man, did they kind of ugly this thing up. And so I want to talk about the, their branding change and just offer some opinions on it. So WPX hosting is what it was called. Now it's simply called WPX, which whatever, I don't really care. And they moved to WPX.net as their domain rather than a .com. That's a little bit of a weird move right there. I don't know why they did that. But the big thing is they made the site ugly and not very good. Now here's the thing, and I'll show it in a minute. Uh, WPX has never really been known for their artistic web design sense anyway. The control panel's never been that great. The site wasn't that great, but they now they've switched it to this really orange and yellowy thing that really just drops the ball in my personal opinion. So let me show it to you. All right, so here is their new homepage. And um, first of all, the color scheme is just atrocious, if you ask me. I don't know why they did this. Um, and it's, you know, this orange and yellow, I, they're very common online for conversion colors, for calls to action, in order to highlight um, certain colors from other colors so that you notice them. That's why orange and yellow and those types of shades are very common for calls to action, add to cart, those types of things. It's almost as if their designer read that someplace and decided to vomit it all over the page um, because everything is that now. Um, and I don't understand why they did it. Now, beyond the color scheme, the other thing is that they're, I don't think they're really hitting the right unique selling proposition anymore. Um, I mean, I'm an RV guy, so I love to go RV camping and stuff. So this is cool. I like this, but it doesn't do anything for me. When I'm shopping for hosting, I am looking for signs of trust and I am looking for Signs of speed and quality. Now, first of all, I don't believe this type of color scheme inspires trust. It's almost like they're trying to go for some type of a lifestyle adventurous type of thing, which if that is what they're going for, I guess they may have nailed it. It just doesn't do much for me. Um, and so are you using your website to change your life? Well, I mean, I don't know. It's just, it's not a headline that really like gets a reaction. Then you need a host you can trust. Fine. Can we be trusted? Really weird button to put on the homepage in my personal opinion. Now they are linking off to Trustpilot and WPX does have some really awesome reviews over there, I will say. Uh, and so it's a good company. I just don't don't know why they f that it's almost like they're coming right off the bat and saying uh you know you probably don't think we're trustworthy and here let us deal with that and, and which i don't like it now if we compare that to the old version that i pulled up in the wayback machine this to me just looks a lot better first of all i like the fact that it's not so blue or sorry so orange and yellowy and nasty like blue is just a more trustworthy color in my opinion this looks a little bit more professional i also like that to me this is the the unique selling proposition of w w PX hosting is that it's fast and it spoke right to that on the home page and it came from a third party which is Matthew Woodward and so that gives it immediate trust and I compare that to this and they just lost it I don't know what the surfer and the RV has to do with any of this uh, as much as I am an RV guy I have no idea why they decided to go with that image um the, the Matthew Woodward thing was a really good thing. If they, if they had pursued this strategy further and maybe even gotten other tech bloggers to, to make similar comparisons, that would be really good proof and would probably make a lot more sales for them. But they sort of understated it down here, in my opinion. Um, and all these weird uh, cartoony, yellowy guys, I don't really understand why they did that.
Now, unfortunately, they carried a lot of this over into their control panel as well. Now, this is inside of my WPX account, which I am going to be getting rid of soon. Um, even though I have really not a lot to say that's bad about WPX, they actually are a really solid company. But I'll, I'll follow up with that stuff later on why I'm switching. But unfortunately, this branding moved into here, uh, really oddball color scheme. Their control panel's never been the best to be honest, but they've made it worse with this big circle and the orange and the yellow and the weird contrasting colors. Um, you know, if we look at some of these lists, it's the buttons look like cartoons. Um, you know, it, it's, I don't know why they made some of the choices that they made. This one, I mean, look at this screen where the buttons are all stacked and it just looks like garbage with a literally a horizontal scroll and this oddball circle sitting over here. Um, I don't get it. I don't know why they did that and I really hope they fix it. Okay, so those are pretty much my thoughts on it. When I originally saw the new WPX branding, uh, I was like, man, how am I gonna have our, I, I, need to be, I need to say something. And the funny thing is, they made a blog post about their change, and I posted a comment on them, not ripping them to shreds, of course, because I, I like the company. They've literally got some of the best support I've ever experienced, and I've been doing this a really, really long time. So. I like the company. I just don't know why they had to take an interface that wasn't that great to begin with and make it so much worse and then position it as if they're making some massive positive change to the brand. I don't really think they did. And so the only reason I'm making this video is A, to get it off my chest and B, I don't know, maybe they'll see it and take it into consideration. I, I, you know, the switch to WPX instead of WPX hosting is fine. I don't know why you had to, to get, go to the .net domain. I think .com would be preferable. But that being said, the color scheme and the messaging uh, does not inspire trust. And this is just an outside viewpoint. It does not make me trust the company. Um, you know, I have experience with them, so I'm good. Um, you know, except I am moving, but it's not got nothing to do with their color scheme. Um, and, uh, but if I was on the outside and I didn't already have that experience, this would not make me want to switch to WPX. It would actually probably make me go away, um, because it doesn't hit the right messaging for me as an outsider. Um, and the colors are just so ugly that it's a little bit, it, 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 you know, it makes me want to stand off from it, actually. All right. So anyway, that is my comment about the WPX. It's a it's a perfectly fine host, um, just really weird color scheme. Uh, and, um, and then later on, I'll follow up with why I am actually switching my accounts off of WPX. Um, it's another story, um, not a bash job on WPX at all. It's just something with my needs. And unfortunately, WPX wasn't really serving anymore. So I'll talk about that one a little later.